Na brakata yahawa, brakata yahusha, brakata yahawa, brakata yahusha, bahashem, rakakwadash, double honor to the apostles, the elders, salutations to you, sincere brothers, teaching and truth and in sincerity. This lesson will be entitled Writing Grievousness. Lord, will you are edified, my source, WJTV, and this article is entitled Jackson Mayor Issues Blank Mandate for City Workers, published as, as of 46 minutes ago. On Wednesday, Jackson Mayor Lumamba signed a blank executive order that requires city employees to provide proof of blank by no later than August 31st, 2021. According to the mayor, reasonable accommodations will be considered on an individualized basis. City employees who choose not to provide proof of their full blank status will have to participate in weekly testing at their own cost and will continue to wear a face covering at all times when at the workplace and or during working hours. The order will take effect on Monday, August 16, 2021. And it states, blank poses a danger to the health and safety of the residents, visitors, and employees of the city of Jackson, said Lubamba, Salaka, said Lumamba. The blank is here and is highly transmissible substantially increasing the risk of infection for not only our employees but the people they come in into contact with every day it is essential that we take every effort to mitigate its spread and promote the best health and safety practices recognized in light of current scientific understanding for health and well-being of our city Now remember, mandate, according to the etymon, is a command or judicial or legal order, but it gets deeper, literally to giving into one's hand, okay? And this is what politician does. They do the bidding for the elite bankers, okay, whether they know or don't know. They are given an agenda and they must carry that agenda out. If not, they're no longer in office. Okay? Mandate to give into one's hand. All right? So, the elite bankers want the inhabitants of the world to receive the MOB. All right? And within their so called new world order. They want to eradicate the nation of Israel from off the face of the earth. Why? Because ultimately, they want that birthright. Okay? But back on point, Isaiah 10 and 1, Woe unto them that decree unrighteous decrees, destruction unto them, referring to the nobility of Edom. Okay? That order unrighteous decrees because everything they formulate okay is unrighteous why because they are the wicked okay they are the wicked and they have nothing to do with the will of Yahweh Bashem Yahweh Shah and that right grievousness which they have prescribed an example of grievousness is that you have to take it or if you don't you have to go through or participate in a weekly testing and you have to pay for it yourself and you must continue to wear a face covering at all times when at the workplace or during working hours okay this is grievousness all right so Either you can take it or don't. However, if you don't take it, you have to follow these stipulations. Okay? This is evident 
that freedom no longer exists, okay? Whether it's regarding speech or you um, physically trying to do something. It's over. Um, One more precept. Revelation 12 and 12, therefore rejoice ye heavens and ye that dwell in them. Woe to the inhabitants of the earth and of the sea, for the devil has come down unto you, having great wrath. All right? And pretty soon this will be enforced by, you know, the military. Because he know that he have but a short time, a short time to do what? To attain the new world order. All right, Lord, will you edify Shalom?